just a little bit of information about my uh, biggest most expensive car ever purchased because uh, this wheel a lot of us most of us many of us have always thought the Range Rover would be the ultimate car uh, it is only in our minds this is my 1991 convertible an old Chevrolet pretty cool little car this is my other such a reliable reliable over the years Toyota 1996 convertible my huge huge investment and so much money for that car and here is my home here's where I park my cars here is where I park my Range Rover as you can see I wish I would have put something in there I'm gonna put my shoes so you can see tell more or less what the size of of his little mark that it leaves I guess he marks it so he'll know that he belongs here <clears throat> but if it's not transmission uh, is uh, fluid uh, coolant is uh, some other source of leakage this is um, for a leakage for the last um, about a week and a half because I do take it into the shop every other week it seems like well that's kind of what it is this is where I park my convertible my convertible and this leakage here is <laughs> 1991 Chevrolet <laughs> convertible over like uh, over the I think I haven't moved it for about a month and a half all right Range Rover cars the most expensive car ever most unreliable piece of shit breakdown every week piece of shit I've ever purchased and this I'm gonna do everything that I can to keep others from purchasing uh, such a thing I purchased it at uh, Redondo Beach uh, Land Rover dealer they lie to me uh, just unbelievably and there's gonna be some other videos that would come along with this Range Rover most expensive most breakdowns most useless truck I've ever had.